So it's also possible to define stagnation variables uh, for other properties. So other state variables in the stagnation state. So, for example, we could think about the density rho t over rho, and well, what would that be equal to? Well, from p equals rho r t, rho t over rho is just p t t over p t t. And so rho t over rho is 1 plus you know, minus 1 over 2 Mach number squared to the gamma over gamma minus 1 minus 1, which is 1 plus gamma minus 1 over 2 m squared to the 1 over gamma minus 1. So you can define these stagnation uh, ratio, stagnation to static quantity ratios for other properties as well. Well, what about entropy? If we wrote ST stagnation entropy minus the static entropy, this would be CP1 PT over T minus R1 PT over P. Now, Remember that the definition here involves T and P, so the definition of stagnation entropy must use the more restrictive of the stagnation quantity, so that's pressure. So what we already said is that if a, for the stagnation pressure um, to be conserved, we must be using a reversible adiabatic process, which means it's an isentropic process. So by definition, the stagnation entropy is the same thing as the entropy. And we can show this. We look at ST minus S, and we put in CP1, PT over T, minus R, gamma over gamma minus 1, 1, PT over T, by substituting N. And we can write this as CP minus CV, then ST minus S equals form of T, T over T, minus 1 minus 1 over gamma, gamma over gamma minus 1, 1, T, T over T. And so non-dimensionalizing, if we take ST minus S over CP, as entropy has the same units as specific heat, then we get 1 is tt over t minus 1 tt over t, which is 0. So again, we get that there's no such thing as stagnation entropy. It's just entropy.